The Mavs stay alive in the NBA Finals with a blowout win in Game 4 to force it to Game 5, heading back to Boston, and they did it by 38 points. Luka Doncic, definitely the leader in this, 29 points, didn't even need to come in the last quarter. There were some great plays, you know, a brilliant Derek Lively dunk. You know, Josh Green with a massive putback as well. It was just amazing to watch. Luca and Kyrie were obviously the main two, you know, some real trick plays. 29 points for Luca, 21 for Kyrie. Did, both of the team starters didn't even play in the last quarter. And that brings me to the point, everything was going right for the Mavs. Everyone played. There was not a single player that got outplayed in any way, or shape or form. And, you know, even the Mavs bench easily outplayed the Celtics bench at the end, like the reserves that don't get much minutes in the last quarter. Great to see them out there. And Tim Hardaway Jr., five threes in a row, kept this game interesting when usually, you know, many people would have left. So Tim Hardaway Jr., shout out. So great game by Dallas and Boston. Well, they need a... Get back. They need to swing some momentum back. They still have another three chances. But, you know, with Luka on this Mavs team and the way that they played in game four, you never know. And, I mean, uh, I'm still buying that Luka jersey if they come back from down 3-0. That, that's still an opportunity. I will buy that Luka jersey. And I will... He, uh, he might be the GOAT, I'm not going to lie, but... I'm still going to go Boston in five. But if they lose Boston, then maybe, just maybe, the Mavs might make some history.